there are a lot of weird liberal narratives the left uses to attack Donald Trump and his administration. There is this strange obsession with Trump's eating habits, the bizarre smear that the president is anti-Irish, and a full frontal assault on VP Mike Pence's pets. Newsweek accused Pence of killing his pets. Comedian Michael Ian Black fantasized about the Veep having sex with his animals, and now John Oliver says the second family's beloved bunny is gay. The Pences have a rabbit named Marlon Bundu, which is as cool as it gets. Their daughter Charlotte published a children's book today called Marlon Bundu's Day in the Life of the Vice President, illustrated by Second Lady Karen. You wouldn't think this would be controversial or even a big deal, but one liberal late-night talk show host sees it as an assault on our freedom or something. John Oliver, host of Last Week Tonight decided he needed to counter this Pence, Bunny hate crime by publishing his own book in which Marlon Bundu is gay. Yeah, this is what the resistance is all about, calling a pet rabbit a homosexual. Isn't making gay jokes considered homophobic or does that only apply when conservatives do them? It turns out, in a complete coincidence, we also wrote a book about Mike Pence's rabbit that is also being published. In fact, while his is out tomorrow, ours is being released right now, said Oliver on his HBO show. And here's what his book is about. Now, there are a few small differences between the two books. You'll notice right away that our rabbit has a bow tie, so there's that. Also, our story is about Marlon Bundu falling in love with another boy rabbit, because our Marlon Bundu is gay just like the real Marlon Bundu. Oliver said. This ain't just a stale joke either. Oliver really did write a gay bunny book and it's available for sale on Amazon with all the profits going to LGBT groups. Here's the description. HBO's Emmy winning Last Week Tonight with John Oliver presents a children's picture book about a very special boy bunny who falls in love with another boy bunny. Meet Marlon Bundu, a lonely bunny who lives with his grandpa, Mike Pence, the Vice President of the United States. But on this very special day, Marlon's life is about to change forever. With its message of tolerance and advocacy, this charming children's book explores issues of same-sex marriage and democracy. Sweet, funny, and beautifully illustrated, this book is dedicated to every bunny who has ever felt different. I wonder if it also graphically describes sodomy to children. Probably. If reading a children's book is too taxing for you. There is an audiobook version available with our Paul narrating. So John Oliver says real-life Marlon Bundu is gay and thought it was important enough to actually write a book for children to explain this. I think this nonsense perfectly sums up what liberalism is all about. Don't you? Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this report? Scroll down to comment below. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more at the best prices, please feel free to visit www.atthismall.com once again that is www.at this more.com